No matter how much we reduce our emissions, we will not be able to address climate change without physically drawing CO2 out of the air and storing it someplace. We need to pull 5 to 10 billion metric tons of carbon dioxide out of the air each year over the next few decades. And there are some surprising ways to do it. My name is Dale Vinson. I do a bunch of different things, all related to sustainability. We have to find a way to bring large amounts of carbon back out of the atmosphere that we put there and lock it up somehow. One solution is to pull in air, remove the carbon dioxide, and pump that deep underground. Capturing carbon this way can be expensive. And Dale's solution is to turn the carbon in the air into something very valuable. I was struck by the simple concept that the most enduring form of carbon that we know about is the diamond. And wouldn't it be amazing to be able to take carbon out of the atmosphere and just lock it up permanently? But into something also that's great fun, we have what we call our sky mining works. And this is where we pull the gases we need from the atmosphere. The carbon captured from the air is fed into a diamond oven, a sealed chamber containing a diamond seed. Under very high temperatures, carbon gas bonds to the seed and forms a diamond. This whole process is fueled by solar and wind power. What we found in the process is the carbon footprint of what we avoid, the diamond mining of the earth, is enormous. It's three days worth of renewable energy to make a single carat of stone that avoids a half a ton of greenhouse gas emissions if you dug that out of the ground. And so it represents a way for us to have the bling that we like, you know, to live this fun lifestyle, but actually without the impact. We like to call it bling without the sting because we miss the environment impact, the social impact, as well as the, as well as the climate impact. You know, this is where we need to be in our industrial processes now. We need to be cleaning up the atmosphere, the land, the water, in the process of making whatever it is that we're making. We've got to reverse the tide of the last 100 years as we make things. Mm -hmm.